Jerry's driving the Tasmanian Devil, and uh, this is actually a tribute car. Jerry, tell us a little bit about how and why. Uh, the car is a tribute, number one, to all the firefighters that perished in the Twin Towers in 2001. 343 firefighters perished. I am a retired firefighter from there, and our, our car number is 343, the amount of firefighters that died. It's also a tribute to the Snizek and Dodge Racing Team, who raced the original Tasmanian Devil in the early 60s and was a national record holder for three years uh, and set many, many records during the five-year run of the car that they had. Uh, set the first U.S. Nationals record at the U.S. Nationals in 1964 at Indy. And, uh, They've over 200 wins in their five-year career. Uh, it was a dream of mine when I was a young kid. Now it's a fantasy come true, and I can enjoy what I'm doing, and 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 I take my time. I, I'm going to learn how to drive it and and be safe. And be safe is the most important thing. Now you got PacersAuto.com on the side. Who's Pacers? Pacers Auto was the actual company that Snizek and Dodge Racing Team were back then. George and Charlie, George Snizek and Charlie Dodge owned Paces Auto on Long Island and their racing team was Snizek and Dodge Racing Team. They used their last names and that's how I was able to contact George two years ago and ask him if he would help me build the car again and he says graciously and I, I asked him if I could still use the car name and also the company name which was 44 years later and he says I would love to help you and here we are 44 years later Tasmanian Devil 2